I'm TJ with No Time Nails, and I thought today I would show you my tips and trick, tricks on how I remove my nail wraps. Let's get Probably one of my most favorite ways to remove my nails is to just soak them off. So what I'm doing right now is I have a small bowl with a little bit of coconut oil in it. So this coconut oil, I've just scooped it out of the jar, put it in the microwave for about 30 to 45 seconds. I like it to be warm, but not hot. And then I just soak my nails right down in that oil and just let it soak up. Now, I often will go through and kind of just use the end of my cuticle pusher to sort of lift a little bit up before I put them in, or I might soak them for a few seconds and then lift them up. So I'm just gonna let those soak for a few minutes and then we will um, take these off. So I've had my um, hands, my hands soaking in this for just a couple of minutes and I thought I would just check to see how they were doing. So I'm just going to um, take the soft end of my cuticle pusher and you can see this is just already lifting up and I just dip my cuticle pusher in the oil and I'm just sliding it back and forth underneath that wrap I'm not forcing it I'm just sliding and if I meet any resistance I'll get a little bit more oil and just slide it the rest of the way off so there it is that's that's the wrap it just slides right off I've gotten um, I've been using this method as my preferred method really all winter because my nails are so dry and my cuticles are so dry that I feel like this is just very nourishing for my skin and not harmful and I always have uh, coconut oil to for cooking so it's just something that's quick and easy and I don't have to worry about making sure I have that um, around um, and certainly my nails and hands could always use that extra moisture and you can see I can usually get these all off in just a few minutes I've literally only soaked these for about three two three minutes and they're just sliding right off and I'll go ahead and show you a couple of other methods So I've just finished removing all of my wraps using the soaking method. You can see they're very, very oily, so I'd want to make sure and wash my hands really good before applying. But I often will then just kind of rub that extra oil just all up in to my nails, into my hands. And sometimes I'll even, if I can, wait maybe 20 or 30 minutes before washing my hands just to let my hands just absorb all that extra moisture and it just really helps nourish my nails. So one of the other methods I mentioned is just some regular nail polish remover. I happen to really enjoy this mineral fusion, but you can certainly use whatever you have on hand. And then I'll usually just tear off a small piece of cotton and put a clip on it. And this might be something that I might be doing, you know, while I'm watching TV or watching a movie with the kids. Um, I can just soak those off easy peasy and I don't have to worry about it. So I'll literally just maybe soak those all off. I just grabbed these clips off Amazon because quite honestly, I could not sell them to you for what Amazon sells them for. I think you can buy them for like less than $5 sometimes. The other method it would just be to get some, some nail polish remover on a cotton ball and just literally, you know, just rub it on that nail polish wrap and it will just, it just dissolves. So that's the other method and you could certainly do that, especially if you're in a hurry and you just need to get them off. You could certainly do that. I do not recommend just peeling them off. I think that tears off a layer of your nail each time. So I try to get in the habit of either using a nail polish remover or soaking them off or something like that. So that's um, one of the other methods is just to put some on a regular old cotton ball and it'll come right off. And I've used all sorts of different nail polish removers and all of them work perfectly fine. I have a really hard time with acetone so I tend to avoid it. And I'm also, you know, usually applying you know, 
a couple sets of wraps a week. And so um, it's just less exposure for me to use it that way. So there you go. I just, what this was this, I just took that clip off and the whole thing was pretty much on the cotton ball. So I'm just using the rest of the cotton ball to clean up the nail. And that is the third method. So there you go. There are three ways to remove your nails. You can just use a small bowl with some coconut oil. I usually recommend using a different colored cuticle pusher than the one you use to apply your wraps because this one's been soaked in oil. And you could use just some regular nail polish remover that whatever works for you. And you can soak them off using one of the clip method or you just take it off with a cotton ball. All three work just perfectly. I'm TJ with No Time Nails, and I hope you've enjoyed this quick video on how to safely remove your nail wraps. Mine are all off. My nails are nice and healthy and nourished and moisturized, and they are ready for me to apply some new wraps.